Hello, beautiful Taurus. I'm Lindsay from Lindsay with Love, and I hope you're having an amazing day. If you're new to my channel, I just want to say welcome. Thanks for stopping by. And for all my returning subscribers who are watching, thank you so much. I'm so grateful for every single one of you because you have all personally helped me continue to reach as many people as I can in this lifetime to hopefully inspire them and empower them to really clear out their chakra system, become a full open channel, and use universal energy to build and attract the life of their dreams. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, on to your readings. This message is for Taurus Sun, Moon, and Rising for September of 2022. And Taurus, as always, these are general messages. So take what resonates, leave the rest behind, and check out your rising sign and your moon sign for a more comprehensive overview of what's happening for you in September of 2022. All right, Taurus. The energy, excuse me, the message that came through when I was meditating on your energy was a rainy day, dot, 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 save it for a rainy day. So once again, a rainy day slash save it for a rainy day. And this is what the guides had me writing out. It says, Taurus, the energy is one of caution, but not meant to scare you. Dot, 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 only meant to prepare you. Okay. We know your desires for security in the material world, and this is an energy of material gains, losses, and security. If you are not feeling financially secure at this time, Taurus, it would, it would be in your best interest to find alternate income streams, review your investments, and view money as a tool. You see, Taurus, money and the material serve a purpose here on Earth, dot, 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 we understand, but it would be wise to save a bit more and work toward living within your means to ensure financial success and security for the long run. We always need a bit extra saved for a rainy day. All right, Taurus, pretty straightforward message, but before we go into dissecting it, I just wanna share with you some recent student and client wins of mine. I really hope you get inspired and you enjoy. I had the gift of healing by Lindsay and I fell in love with her. Her loving energy was so calming for me. I was holding so much heaviness in my chest, I just couldn't let it go. Her intuition was right on and knew exactly what I needed. She is so connected and I will for sure be going back for more. I definitely recommend her and, will, and you will not be disappointed. Thank you so much, Lindsay. And Taurus, as a reminder, I'm an energy coach, once again, helping my students release those blockages that are keeping them really chained basically to mediocre life, to being stuck in these cycles after cycles after cycles, not actually getting anywhere, just running on that hamster wheel. Once you unstick yourself, unstuck yourself, on whatever yourself, <laughs> you will actually be able to use your high vibrational energy to create with the universal energy and you will actually get to see your manifestations unfold in front of your eyes in real life. You'll be so aware that you will be like, that's a sign, that's a sign. I'm being guided here, here, here. It is, it's literally the coolest thing. I'm so excited when I teach my students, I'm so excited that I can do it for myself and my partner and my family. So if that's something you're interested in doing with me, you can click the link in the description box below. All right, let's chat about it, Taurus. So nothing too bad here, right? Pretty kind of straightforward. I know from my astrology studies, the Taurus, the Taurians, Taurians? I'll have to look that up. In the world, enjoy um, the material, the financial. They just enjoy the security too, I think. So this is nothing new, I don't think, for you. Likely, you're, you're probably like, yeah, that's me. Um, and they're really just saying, you know, find, create like a savings bucket or, or start looking more at your investments and like where you can maybe move money around or something to really, really keep yourself like having a nice, savings a nice cushion for that rainy day right and the, uh, the rainy day by the way could be a splurge like it's a rainy day and i'm gonna go spend the day at the mall shopping because it's raining out and i'm indoors and i get to spend a little money and have some fun or it could be like the rainy day is like woe is me my car broke down i need money right kind of both ways um either way it just seems like it would serve you best to either start working on a new income stream which if you need help with that, let me know in the comments. I have, I have a bunch of ideas and I'm working on some myself. Um, look at your investments and then view money as a tool. Of course, money is a tool, right? Money is just another form of energy, one that we use to exchange goods and services. So it's definitely a tool. And um, 
seems like life is good for you, Taurus, okay? So not much else to say. I hope you enjoyed this message. If you did, please comment, like, subscribe, and share. Do one of them, do all of them. Either way, it really helps me reach as many people as I can in my lifetime, in my physical body here on earth to help them heal and to really help them live an amazing life because that's what we came here to do. We did not come here to suffer. So Taurus, I hope you have a wonderful September and I hope to see you next week.